Halo teman-teman semuanya, balik lagi dengan saya Reza uh, Sekarang saya mau main game Man of Medan ya. Saya melanjutkan game yang kemarin Kalau misalkan nggak salah, uh, kemarin tuh kita udah di kapal boot ya uh, Kita ada 5 orang, si Conrad, Brad, uh, terus Alex, Julia, sama Selfies Nah Selfies ini uh, yang punya bootnya gitu ya Uh, kemarin udah uh, mulai masuk nyelam gitu ya diving ke uh, kapal yang udah tenggelam kayak gitu ya kita ngelihat orang-orang yang udah mati di sana gitu ya nah sekarang kita melanjutkan uh, adegan selanjutnya gitu ya game selanjutnya oke okay, kita langsung mulai ke in game nya oke okay, kita balik lagi mungkin ya ke Boot yang bernama Duke of Milan Kita balik lagi ke Bapak-bapak ini ya Yang lagi menceritakan Adegan Man of Medan ini You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then Alex okay. and his little brother Brad Trying to swim with the big fish Both yeah. seem out of their depth mm -hmm. and Julia and the Julia. love of Alex's life and he the love of hers yeah what I'm about Conrad a bold fellow you might say or maybe you'd say arrogant yeah betul. and then there's Captain Fliss arrogant. strong forthright yeah. stubborn Stubble. Stubble. do I detect a spark between her and Conrad Let me reassure you, you help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. Hmm. You're doing well. Hmm. Okay. Memberitahu sifat-sifat uh, sedikit, sifat-sifat mereka dan keadaan yang sekarang ya. Kita balik so, lagi ke... So, we're like 10 seconds out of the jaws of certain death. Well, we're certain. Yeah, I mean, that's the... relevant. And this meatball... Us. Meatball? This meatball pulls a ring out of God knows where. Yeah, where did you hide the ring? A lady never tells. Well, needless to say, this lady was impressed. <laughs> well played there, man, no? Wasn't Comrade gonna get us some more beers after he helped Fliss? Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some, and then he got drunk. Mm -hmm. And since he was drunk, he forgot to bring it to us. And he just kept on drinking, and he drank all of it. Uh, sounds like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. Okay. Oh, we found a bullet lodged in the plane. Huh. Si Brad udah I left it below deck if you want to check it out. Gak tau karena emang bootnya lagi so, diem aja gitu. How does it feel to soon maju. be known as the Mrs. Julia Smith? Mabok lagi. Uh, bentar, bentar, bentar. Honestly? I wasn't sure how it would feel, but now that I hear it, it does have a nice ring. So, I guess we should talk about wedding plans, mm -hmm. eventually. Uh, okay. That's now you're speaking my language. And taking lessons. Yeah, I can't wait for us to plan everything together. I was so worried you might say no. Mm -hmm. Of course. Of course I was gonna say yes, you dimwit. I'm happy you did. Yeah. The second you said yes, I could see our whole future rolling out ahead of us. Mm -hmm. I love you, Alex. Uh... Where did everyone go? There was much celebration to be had. I'll go find them. You just relax. Hey, you seen my brother? Or Fliss? Mm -hmm. Uh, no, I... Uh... Got distracted. Let's go get him. Sure. Oh, shit. Coast Guard! The Coast Guard are here! What? Everybody flush their meth! We gotta get rid of all this meth! We can't let them take us alive! <laughs> what the fuck? You can't fuck around like that, Julia. Oh yeah, the beers. <laughs> I was just getting them now. Iseng ya. Padahal kita bisa milih yang kiri loh. 
kan kita ya udahlah iseng aja pilih yang kanan. Mereka lagi asik asik ya, malah diganggu. Alright, now that everybody's here, let's take a look at the navigator's pad we found. Maybe we can figure Tinggal out why si the plane was out here. Where'd you put it? It's in your case. Yeah. Okay, I'll go get it. Hey. Ini yang pakai kacamata itu tuh si Brad. Apa nih? Kita lihat dulu ya. Hasil foto yang tadi. Kenapa gak bisa ya? Oh iya. Lihat dulu. Why did you do it on the dime? Okay. Terus ya? Oh. Hmm, yang tadi buat diving kayak gitu tuh seru loh Kayak kita masuk ke dunia yang baru gitu loh. Apalagi ke tempat-tempat yang kayak gitu Tapi ya kaget juga kalau misalkan ada sesuatu Oke, okay, sudah Eh, gak dimatiin lagi dong Mati lagi dong Masih habis nih baterainya Bentar, kita matiin dulu ya Tunggu sampai Hitam layarnya Hey, got the pad yet? Sorry, I got distracted No worries, let's go get it Kok udah sih? Bentar Got it. Let's go up. Come here, you vixen. Easy, Tiger. We should get back. Kita mungkin bakalan next atau skip di adegan-adegan yang seperti itunya ya. Atau kita tutup. Karena takutnya banyak anak-anak yang nonton. You get no resistance there. All right, everyone. Check it out. Manchurian gold. Who wants to find some sunken treasure? So, what do you think, Captain? Coordinates? Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's destination. You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple hours if the weather stays steady. Wow. You find anything else? This plane must have been shot down because it was riddled with bullet holes. I found one lodged in the fuselage. Huh. And it was full of life rafts. Must have gotten shot down before they could deliver all the rafts. There was only one missing. Reckless. All of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the law. No, hey. They were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. Whatever you took, it was too much. Eh? You need to work. You're right. We should have been more careful. That's not me. I'm sorry. Okay. Maybe. I don't know you. You should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. I never thought about it like that. You never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? Huh? Yeah, I heard a story. It happened right around here, too. Let's hear it. We could all use a good show. I don't know if Brad is really the scary type, you know? Well, don't get too confident. This is a pretty scary story. Scare away, little bro. Okay, here goes. This story is true. It had happened right near here, in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait, true story? Where'd you hear this? If you need to know, it's ripped right from the rotting pages of the terrifying ancient in-flight magazine I was perusing on our way here. The lighthouse stood atop an atoll, isolated from the rest of the world, a lone beacon in the night, mm. a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman, covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid, and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. Ini, ini, ini. Kita coba ya. 
The woman answers. I live here, in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twist. Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, that isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical, and his sister parents are upstairs. So, they go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, splayed out on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. Always an axe. I mean, do people even use axes anymore? I'm just reporting the facts, cliches and all. Chopped up into little tiny giblets with an axe. So gross. Okay, so who did it? So the woman, uh, she's still hysterical, says her husband did it. And he's still here, in the closet. Ha, <laughs> the husband, eh? <laughs> So is this a warning to all future brides? Hey, no back seats. You're locked in. So the lighthouse keeper creeps over to the closet, opens the door, and sure enough, there's a man inside. But he's cut his own throat. Horrified, he looks closer to see the dead man's face in the dark. Closer, closer. And he sees it's his own face and then its eyes bulge out and screams. <laughs> yeah, so gross. Hey, oh, super twist. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice one, Squire. I the tree. Cool story. You have me going. Pretty cool. Heavy on the cheese there, corn dog. Okay. okay, you've all had your fun. We should all turn in. There's some weather hitting our way. Uh-uh. No, no, no. No, because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required one more beer before hitting the hay. What regulations are these? Uh, <laughs> standard issue regulatory institutional protocol subdivision 1099. Uh-huh. <laughs> Where'd you read that? The internet. Oh, so you found a website that tells you to drink beer under every circumstance. I'm just following orders, man. <laughs> I'm into this website. 10-4, <laughs> <laughs> good buddy. And I'm out. Done. Okay. 
think so. Si Brick ada. These are kind of maybe the fishermen I pissed off earlier. Oh, God damn it, Conrad. Great, just great. And the good news? Uh, I recognize them. How was that good news? I thought you were going to ask the good news first. You're such an idiot. Jesus. Hey. Alex, what are they going to do to us? I don't even want to know. I'm going to get out of here. We're in a lot of danger. Yeah. Guys. Gotta get untied, like now. Come on. 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 Come Nobody knows you're out here, little lady. You're all alone with us now. Let's make the most of it. You can go fuck yourself, you piece of shit. You're the little lady. No, I didn't. I hope he's alright. 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 Hey, hey, 
Are you okay? What did they do to you? I'm fine. They didn't touch me. They asked about our parents. What? How much money they have. Alex, I'm so sorry. What? What is it? They took my ring. <sighs> Julia, it's okay. It's okay. to wait and see what they want to do with us. Got a gun. Well, at least one of us can get on their boat. Get some help. If you can distract them, I can get on that boat. The dude with the gun won't even realize it until I'm gone. Seven seconds. I can get out through the window. We gotta break these off first. Too loud. They'll hear it. We're gonna break them during the thunder. Good call. I'll go through the window and get the boat. You guys distract them. Conrad, just. Stay focused and get to the boat. Okay, let's do it. Okay. Olsen, come here. Which one of you is going to tell me about this Manchurian do? Hey, 
All right. You gave it your best shot. All right. Shut the fuck up. There is no harm in just talking. You want to talk? Keep the volume down. I'm just going to say it. Fliss has got to be in on this. She and these guys, they travel in the same waters. She's the captain and they barely laid a hand on her? I bet you told them about the Manchurian gold. They're in cahoots. I can't believe what I'm hearing. I just lost everything I have and this is what you think? You're all in this together. This was a trap and you set us that up. Yeah, so. What a cork in it. <sighs> Sit still, all of you. You, come with me. Hey, leave her alone. This one, yeah. Good day, huh? You, come with me. Find out how long the storm is gonna last. You try anything, anything fishy, and there'll be consequences. Uh, get it. Hey, Ada pilihan lagi nggak? Duke of Milan requesting weather update. Over. Duke, we read you. Everything okay? Over. Hey, uh, just requesting any information about this storm you can give us. It's a little bit hairy out here. Over. Big storm coming in from the east. Gonna hit you pretty hard, but should pass through your coordinates within an hour. You sound a little stressed, Duke. Please let me know if you need assistance. Not used to a little weather freaking you out. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. A-OK -okay out here. We can handle a couple bucks yeah, and drops of rain. Uh, thanks for the info. We'll see you for drinks back on shore in a couple of days. Looking after number one. Real smooth. Great leadership, Fliss. Anyone know about Brad? Is he hiding somewhere? I don't know where he is. Kita jangan salah pilih lagi ya. Ah. Okay, keep a lid on it. It could be our ticket out. Brad stays hidden. Better off down there than with these psychos. Oh yeah, great. He could get killed down there. Brad's a big boy. He'll be okay. And it's probably better for us if he stays put for now. Everyone's still alive. Okay, teman-teman. Uh, could have been quite different. Okay, seru. 
Makin seru-seru ya. E, part 3 sampai sini dulu. Kita lanjut part 4. Pasti akan lebih seru lagi gitu ya. E, tadi di perahu terus ketemu perahu yang lebih besar lagi dan perahu yang lebih besar lagi am, itu kayaknya like perahu yang waktu di part pertama oke okay, nanti langsung aja ke part selanjutnya thank you yang udah nonton thank you yang udah stand by sampai jumpa lagi I presume you're eager to get back to your...